morning guys, Charles Welly here, GM Bloomington Edge, Separation Saturday. That's what I'm calling it today. No, it's not some lame marketing thing that they came up with over at some sports broadcasting show to talk about the, the football games today. It's how you can separate yourself from the competition today on Saturday. How you can separate yourself from the other people you work with, other people you're working against, maybe the people, the job that you want, things like that. Now you might be thinking, well, we're not competing. You are absolutely competing. You're competing for the next job, a promotion, a raise, a bigger, bigger brand. You're always competing. The people that are trying to convince you that you're not competing are the people that are competing against you and taking all of your market share. It's a competition every day. It's a race. And if you're still at the finish line, you're getting beat. you got to get going. Okay, so this Saturday, while a lot of people are hanging out at the pool, relaxing, we're going to work, right? We're going to get some things done. If you don't have anything to do, I'm going to give you three quick things you can do today, right now, that are going to make you better at your job, better at whatever your goals are, working towards them so you're up and at them, better to make connections, okay? So here's three things that you can do right now. Number one, go to LinkedIn, okay? If you haven't boosted out your profile, do it already, and then start connecting on LinkedIn. Okay, there's a couple different ways I want you to do it. First, I want you to do some searches, and I want you to find people that you have a connection to, preferably in the city or town where you live. People that went to college with you, people that went to high school with you, maybe here from a small town, see if they're from the same town as you. Find people that are connected to you in some way already, and then send them a connection, okay? Send them a customized connection that says, hey, we went to the same high school, I see that we're both in the same field, let's connect. Or maybe someone that works in the same building with you, if you work in a big building with lots of office space, maybe they work in the same building with you and you never met, right? So do searches like that. Find 20 people and send them uh, connect requests. Customized, not the standard linked one. Custom, customized connect requests. At least 10 of those people will, will accept your connection, if not more. When you get those acceptance, go ahead and send them an IM. Send them a message. Hey, thanks for connecting. I noticed that we work in the same building. Hey, it's cool. We went to the same school. Yada, yada, yada. Of those 10, five of them at least, maybe more, will get back to you. You can start a little conversation. And then, here's the kicker. Ask them to meet you next week. Hey, it's so cool that we linked up on here. Let's meet for coffee next week. So if you send out 20 links and you get 10 back and you start a conversation with five or six, you should be able to get at least two of them to meet you for coffee. If you do that Saturday and Sunday, that's four new meetings a week. Times that times 52 weeks, you're meeting over 200 new people every year. It's very simple. You can do it from your couch. It's going to take you less than an hour. Get on started on that right away. Now, if you want to be a little more proactive, Pull up your computer, go to your Facebook page and go to Facebook events or find your, your local tourist website that says uh, visit, like for us it's visit BN. Find events that are going on in town today. Find a 5K, find a charity walk, find a fundraiser, things like that and get up right now. As soon as you find it, don't wait, get up and go to that event right now. Find the event organizer, they usually have a walkie talkie and a bullhorn, say hey I'm here to volunteer, sorry I just found out about it today but this cause means a lot to me, how can I help? See if they'll put you to work. Okay, spend the afternoon outside helping people. All the other volunteers there are people that you're going to want to meet. And you'll also make sure you're getting connections with the people that are running the organization. And there you go. It's a great way to connect, great way to help people, great way to be outside. Next, find a youth sporting event, right? Youth football, youth basketball, uh, anything like that. I mean, youth football is going on right now. Volleyball is going on right now. Um, even maybe some, some baseball. Some places have it year-round. Go to the field where they play. Same thing, ask them if they need any volunteers. Okay, maybe they need help running the scoreboard, they need help with the concession stand, whatever. Now, if you want to take your marketing to the next level, your networking to the next level, look at these organizations in advance, the ones that are holding the 5Ks, these youth sports groups. See who's on the board of directors, see who else is involved, go to their pages, see who's sponsoring them. If you're, if you're in B2B sales and there's a big company you've been trying to get, get inside or get a, a foothold with and you haven't, they're, they're sponsoring somebody, they're involved with the 5K somewhere. Find what they're involved in and be involved with the same things. Doesn't that make sense? And then you'll be able to run into the people you want to run into with, but you'll also be meeting them and making connections with them naturally, not forced through a cold call or an email. That's what you should be doing on Saturday. That's how you should be separating yourself from the competition. Guys, every day is a competition. Are you trying to win your day, win your week, win your weekend? Are you trying to dominate your job or are you just surviving? If you're surviving, you're just going to get past. Now, I'm on the couch right now, but I won't be for long. I'm about to split. I'm doing all three of those things in order today. So I, I know I'm going to dominate my Saturday. I hope you do too. I hope you dominate your Sunday as well. Have a great weekend. Well, the out.